The Nye County Sheriff's Office dispatch has been remodeled. We're going to speak to Captain Bill Becht. Back, started about six months ago, was the process with the commissioners approving it, and, and we purchased the furniture from Zybex, mm -hmm. and it was just installed. They just completed the install late last week, and we got moved in. Uh, today was like really the first official day we've moved in. We've been phasing in, but yeah. What exactly was remodeled in that one room? All the furnishings, all the, the computers and the radios and things like that, those were reused and recycled. Mm -hmm. But all the furnishings, mm -hmm. the, the dispatch counters and things like that were what was falling apart and what was replaced. They were installed in 1999 mm -hmm. with, the, with the original building and served 24-7. Uh, actually, 14 years isn't a bad life expectancy for that furniture, for that mm -hmm. type of, uh, of use. Mm -hmm. You know, but everything wears out. What was it like before? You talked about uh, some of the keyboards being held up by books and stuff. Tell me about so, that. Yeah, some of the keyboard trays were constantly being pieced together, being held up with books. Uh, we had milk crates wedged in certain places mm -hmm. uh, and so forth, and it generally was just in, starting to come in disrepair. How much did it cost total? The estimate was 63000 I mean, I don't know what the dollars and cents came in at. Obviously, we came in under budget, mm -hmm. but I don't know what the exact dollars and cents were, but yes. You guys were displaced for a short period of time. Yeah, we had to move into, we moved into our training center. Everything had to be shifted because we couldn't just shut down dispatch. Mm -hmm. So we, we transferred operations to the training room mm -hmm. for about three, three and a half weeks. It took to get everything done and coordinated. Uh, buildings and grounds painted for us. They installed new flooring, mm -hmm. the whole nine yards. It's a thousand percent better, thanks to everybody. That's one thing that people don't realize. With dispatch, this is a 24-hour job just like being a Nye County Sheriff. But these people that are operating in dispatch can't leave their location there. So it is important. We saw the trays, the um, the tables, and the computers raise up and down. Why is that important? Well, again, it's, it's for the ergonomics uh, to prevent repetitive use injuries and, and things like that and stress on the body, mm -hmm. allow them to stand up. It changes their positioning of their hands so they don't get the carpal tunnel syndrome and things like that over the years. So they can walk around just in case they need to get some circulation going. You seem to have two dispatchers in there, but you have uh, uh, areas for how many total? Up to four stations we have, yes. And are you using those right now at this point? No, normally we have two to three people in there. Mm -hmm. There's always the room for expansion. These are not new computer systems for the dispatchers in there. These are the same ones that they had before? Yes. The monitors are the, are the same. Mm -hmm. The computers are the same. The radios are the same, yes. So how, what are you hearing from uh, the dispatchers? Are? They're, they're all very happy. It's like you heard. I mean, God, I hate to say it, but they were so used to working in a uh, kind of a dingy, dreary place with the, with the furniture breaking mm -hmm. on a fairly regular basis that... This is fantastic. They love it. And they could also uh, do their job better and are happier employees as well as m make sure that uh, health-wise that they're taken care of. Yes. Yeah, because again, their comfort level. And the captain has so many people to thank for this remodel. He would like to, of course, thank the Nye County Commissioners, the Nye County Manager, and all others who helped during this remodel. This is Deanna O'Donnell for News 46.